This is a seated hamstring curl. This emphasizes more of the inside of the hamstrings or the medial hamstrings. What you'll want to see from the side angle is that the pad is locked down leverage to help keep me in place. I'm keeping my lower back on the back pad the entire time, best I can, and I've got enough room to bend my knees as much as I need to, at least a 90 degree angle. I'm gonna hold on to help keep my lower back back there, and I'm gonna have my feet, knees, and hips in a straight line. Feet are no wider than hip width apart. See how there's a straight line with my feet, knees, and hips? And I'm gonna hold on so I can keep my lower back on the back pad. I'm gonna exhale and pull my heels towards my butt, squeeze the back of the thighs, come up slowly with control, make sure we're not getting any momentum. You can also see that my feet are pulled towards me to maximize the tension in my hamstrings, to minimize the tension in my calves. The calves love to help out on any hamstring exercise. Inhale as you straighten those legs out. Exhale as you squeeze, bringing those heels as close to your butt as you can, keeping those feet dorsiflexed, AKA tops of the feet pointed towards you.